Well, everybody, hope we are fit and well, ready to go. So we're a little bit different this morning. We're going to do a bit more of an interval sort of type based session. So maybe fractionally quicker, but still focusing on getting our techniques correct. So not as many exercises, but we're doing a couple of rounds of each set of exercises. So slightly different. But we'll start off setting ourselves up warm enough as normal. So stand nice and tall, engaging that core, drawing the tummy in. Shoulders back and wake up those senses. With a little rock forwards and back. Take that step if you think you're going to fall. Just wake up those senses. Trigger those reflexes. That's it. Do it a couple more times. Nicely balanced, not falling forwards or back. Nice to set hands onto hips or one hand from behind. And you're going to loosen up that lower back, set that neutral spine. So just tilting that pelvis under and then put the arch to the bottom of the spine. That's it. Good. Nice and steady. You may want to soften the knees, which again helps set that neutral spine. Couple more. And then find that spot now. Should be nice and balanced. Have a neutral spine. And we'll get those feet moving. Pedaling those feet. Pushing them down into the ground. Pressing down through the ball of the foot. Arms in that natural walking movement from the shoulder. Opposite arm to opposite leg. Gradually let the arm movement increase. That's good. Really picking it up, lifting those arms, bringing them all the way up. So we're opening out, stretching out that chest and shoulders. One more each way, and bring that back to centre, just let your balance come back, 
Okay, so we're standing nice and tall. You're going to take those hands above your head, reach it over. Get a really good stretch down our sides. A few more, and then we'll add it into that windmill where we'll take it all the way around. So next time, we flow all the way, round in front, up and chain. That's it. Support with your balance. Good, couple more. And bring that down. Reset. Switch over to the other leg. Start with that sweep. Nice and steady. those toes if you want. Take it high. Bottom. 
let it hang. And then just bend your knee slightly and arch that spine. Put your hands on your knees for support if it's easier. And then raise that head, drop the spine. So we've got that standing calf stretch. Arch the spine. Once more each way. Drop that down. Head up. Now arch that spine. And let's unroll that. Bringing it back up. Well done. Okay, so, so we're going to do a bit of an interval based workout. So what we've got is blocks of three exercises. We'll have one on our front, one on our side, one on our back. 45 seconds. 15 second gap in between. We'll do each set three times. So a bit of an interval based workout. Okay. So we're gonna start with a superman. A side single leg lift and you roll back. So you stand a sort of reverse sit up. Okay, there are our first three. We'll do that three times. With your leg lift, alternate your sides and on your third one, We'll have to flip halfway so you do both sides the same number of times. Okay? So, starting with your Superman. Got a few more seconds breathing before we're going to pick it up. So, take that time, grab a drink if you need, get yourselves in position on your mat. So, remember we're extending nice and long and straight. Want that long, flat, straight line. Arm in front, opposite leg, straight behind. Try not to go too high. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Still focus on your technique. Think about keeping that long straight line. Back level, shoulders and hips flat. Five seconds. And rest. So we're on to our side, we're extended long for that single leg lift. Doesn't matter which side we start on, we'll do them all. So we're extended long, arm under your head, hand in front, go. That's it, keep it going nice and steady. That leg doesn't need to lift super high. We're making sure we're keeping those hips stacked, one on top of the other, we're not rolling back onto the bum. Fifteen more seconds. And rest that down. Coming over into our sitting position. So we're going for our roll back. So we start back vertical, knees bent, arms forward, roll it back. Just back to vertical. Nice and steady. Focus on that technique still. We're not trying to go for a sit up record, so we're not going quickly. We're doing them right. Putting this interval for that. Excellent. Keeping that going. Three, two, one. Okay, so we're back over to our Superman. Back into that kneeling box position. 
same again, 45 seconds. When we're ready, let's go. Really good, keep that going, nice and long, straight line. Good, a few more seconds. And change. Down onto your side, over onto the other side than you were last time. Single leg lift. Legs extended, arm on the head, let's go. Remember try and draw that waist away from your mat if you can. Hips stacked. Toes pointing forwards rather than to the ceiling. That's it, really good. Fantastic, well done. Remember our next exercise, we'll go back over into those rollbacks in a few seconds. In three, two, one, let's sit over. Into that sitting position, knees bent, back nice and tall, those arms forwards. Let's go. Excellent, keeping that going. Rolling back as far as you feel comfortable. If that's just past vertical, absolutely fine. You're taking that a little bit further, closer to the mat. Brilliant, well done. Just try not to go all the way down. We've got a little rest in between. Two more. Last one. And bring that up, well done. We're back over for our final round. So start with your Superman. So back into that kneeling box. Are we ready? Let's go. When we go on to our sides, I'll call it halfway. Quick change to the other side. to our sides. We'll need to switch halfway through this one. I'll give you a few second warning. Are we ready? Let's go. Good. Three, two, one, switching sides. Roll over, off whip round, straight in. That's good. Three, two, one, well done. Back over to our roll backs. So into that sitting position. Back straight, 
arms forwards. Right, let's take it back. Our next block of exercises will be an arm and leg lift, laying on our front, into a climb and into a bridge. So we need to start laying face down on the mat, elbows up at 90 degrees to shoulders. And you'll raise one arm and the opposite leg off the ground. We know how to do a climb, we've done that most weeks, and we know how to do our bridge. That's good, a few more seconds. And let's change. So we're face down on the mat, legs extended, arms in that position, one arm, opposite leg. Ready. Same again, 45 seconds. Let's go. Right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg. Muscles out the back of the shoulder, raising the arm. Lower back, glute and hamstring, lift the leg. Excellent, keep going. A few more seconds. Three, two, one. Onto your side. Arm under your head, knees bent up at roughly 90 degrees. Feet and knees off the ground. Into that climb movement. Remember, try not to roll back on the bum, keeping those hips stacked. That's good. So like last time with this exercise, this round on one side, next round on the other side, third round we'll flip halfway. Ten more seconds. And rest that down. We're going over to do a bridge. So we're going to lay back, knees bent, feet close into the bum. When we're ready, let's go. Tilt that pelvis, peel the back off the back. Roll it down. So tilt, heel up, push up, and down. So we're not going too fast. Still focusing on that technique. So we're back to our arm and leg lift after this one. More seconds. In three, two, one. Let's take it back over. Face down on your mat. Legs extended behind, arms at 90 degrees. Are we ready? Let's go. So we're not raising the torso, keeping that forearm parallel to the ground. So you use the shoulder to lift the arm, the glutes mainly to lift the leg. Legs straight, stay straight. Excellent, keeping that going. Two more seconds. And we're over into that climb on the opposite side to last time. Let's get in position. So we're laying on our sides, arm under your head, knees bent, feet together, 
Lift off the floor if you can. And that top knee opens up. Pivot in at feet and hips. Trying to keep those hips stacked, not rolling back. Excellent. seconds now. Three, two, one. And we're over onto our back. Into that position for our bridge. So laying back. Knees bent. Feet close in. When we're ready, we're going to take it up. Till that pelvis peel in the back of the floor. We'll work the time. Roll it back down. Till the pelvis peel it up. Pushing the hips up and down. That's it. Really good. Nice and steady. So remember the next round, when we get to our clan movement, we'll split it halfway. I'll give you that, sec that few seconds countdown to roll over. First, in the five seconds, we go back over onto our front for our arm and leg lift. In two, one, taking it over. Face down on your mats. That's it. Arms at 90 degrees and lift. Seconds one side, roll ourselves over. Let's go. Lifting that top knee, pivoting that up, keeping those hips stacked. Getting ready, we'll change in five, four, three, two, one. Roll it over, flip sides. Straight in. Keeping that nicely lifted, pivoting at that hip and at the feet. Three, two, one. Bring that down. We're over onto our backs, ready to go into our bridge. And take it up. So our next three exercises will be a swim, so arms and legs together. We're then going to do our open door with the arms on our side. And into a toe tap for the exercise on our back. So our first exercise will be laying, extended arms forward, legs straight behind. Doing that doggy paddle swim. Two more seconds. Three, two, one. Bringing it down. Well done. So this time on our fronts, 
hands forward. We're going to paddle those hands, love to kick those feet. Get yourselves extended and off we go. Remember to keep breathing through this one. It's a real temptation to just grit those teeth and hold your breath. It's quite a long time to do this exercise for. If you need to break it up, take a few seconds, absolutely fine. Really good. So after this we that open door. In three, two, one. Onto our sides. Knees bent, arms at 90 degrees to the body. One hand on top of the other. We raise that top hand, we follow it over with our eyes. Let's go. And back. This is a lovely stretch, your knees out. Again, for this one. This side, first rep. Other side, second rep. Third one, we'll split it. That's good, keep that going. Seconds, then we're back over to our swim and change. So we face down on that mat, arms extended, legs long behind. Let's go. You need to rest your head down, absolutely fine. If you need a little breather, just take one when you need. Keep breathing, just nice and steady. Just a few more seconds. side to last time if you can remember and extend it out other arm on top knees bent and take it over and back eyes follow that hand bring that round and together fantastic keeping it going Good, 10 more seconds. Then we're into our toe taps. And let's change. So on to your back. Into that tabletop position with legs. 
hands to the ceiling like a dead bug. When we're ready, let's go. Tapping it down. You want to coincide that breathing. Breathe in as you drop down, out as you lift back. That's it, breathing in and out. Good, breathe in, breathe out. Fantastic, keeping that going. Really nice and steady. Try not to let that arch in the lower back exaggerate. Keep that nice and neutral in your natural position. Whether that's got a curve or it's flat on the floor, whatever's your natural there. Three, two, one. Okay, into our last block. We started with a VW, so just the arms. So it's up of the front body, down, extend, back down, just the arms. Then scissors on our sides, and then a leg raise. So straight into your VW, let's go. Arms only. Side, long legs, arm under the head, hand in front of the support, 
a little scissor of those legs, forwards and back. I think we're only going to have time for two rounds on this one. So just one on each side for the scissors. That's it. So we've got our leg raised next, we lay on our back, hands tucked under form, legs extended long, we lift them and bring the knees in, in 10 seconds, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, roll onto your back, laying flat, legs extended long, hands under the bum, you're going to raise the feet, bring them in, extend and lower. That's it, let's go. If you do find that really difficult, you can just slide the feet in and out. If you can lift, bring them in, fantastic. Remember, there's only one more round of exercises after this. One set of BWs, one set of scissors, and one more set of leg lifts. That's it, keep going. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Back over onto your front. Arms extended in that V. Up we go. Squeeze, extend, lower. So when we're ready, let's go. One more exercise after this and quick stretch. If you do need to rush for a nine o'clock meeting, just make sure you do a little bit of a stretch when you finish or when you've got time. That's good, a few more seconds. 15 to be precise. Keeping that going. That's a really good. Three, two, one. Our last exercise coming up now. Lay it back. Tuck those hands under the bum. Legs long and straight. We're going to lift and bring them in. Extend and lower. So those feet travel in a semicircle. So the lift and curve in, the curve back out and lower. That's it. Really good. 20 seconds. Your last 20 seconds of effort, come on. Doing really well. That's it. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower it down, excellent, well done. Slowly come to sitting. 
And we're going to slowly come back to our feet. Bringing that back up. Excellent. Well done. Okay, have a little stretch then. Taking that foot back. Bend that front knee. Back leg straight. Hands together. Reach that out in front. That's it. Good. Bring that in. Switch legs. Opposite leg goes back. Front knee bends, hands into the small of the back, chest forward, shoulder blades together. That's it. Bring that foot back in. Send those feet wide. You're going to take a stretch over. Back down, over the other side. back in, hands come high, let's take that down, straight towards the toe, slowly raising that back up, picking up one foot, that's it, we'll change legs,